Craig Bryce starts rolling on Sunday. And as you can imagine, there are a lot of last minute things to get done before hitting the road. KCCI's Marcus McIntosh joins us live from West Des Moines with more on those last minute preps. Hi, Marcus. Hi, Stacy and Kevin. We are outside of Rasmussen Bike Shop right now, but early today we were inside the bike shop where the employees here are doing whatever they can to make sure bikes are rag by ready. And they will continue that effort to make sure bikes are rag by sound along the route. Elaine Kai has been mountain biking for almost a decade. I said I would never ever do rag by. That is what Elaine used to say. Now it's different. The mountain biker is here at Rasmussen getting her bike shoes checked, getting supplements, extra tubes, and everything else she needs for the week long ride across the state. But I'm just going to go with an open mind and know that I'm going to have a lot of fun. Elaine, one of a number of people keeping bike shops like Rasmussen very busy. Everybody needs a tune up on their bike, flat tires, new tires for rag bride. Break pads, all kinds of stuff. The work for Rasmussen employees will not end Sunday with the beginning of Rag Ride. Buchanan is getting a trailer all geared up to support riders on the Rag Ride route. He expects to go through seven to eight hundred inner tubes and some five hundred tires. He says what they're going through this week can't compete with next week. Ten times worse. <laughs> you know, you've got. 20,000 people populated in one little area. Signa Johnson, another first time rider who made sure her bike is ready. I just got my handlebars re wrapped. I got some saddlebags made. Um, just kind of general maintenance. But Johnson may not have trained as much as she should, but has no plans on letting that interfere with her week long adventure. I'm sure I haven't gotten enough miles in, but it'll be fun. It's not like I'll have to work in the evening or something. It'll be relaxing. Now, Johnson says she might not be ready, but her bike is, so she's going to take her time and have fun on Rag Ride, visiting some of the small towns she normally probably wouldn't get to. So she's ready to have fun and have a good time. And you know what? People will be wearing a helmet. I don't have one on now, Stacy, but people on Rag Ride will be wearing helmets. I was only going like 20 or 30 feet on the bike, so I thought I'd be okay without a helmet. So let's go back to you in the studio. <laughs> All right, Marcus, thank you.